Yeah, so um, I've been sort of uh, looking at and uh, reading about how Jacob Epstein worked, and one of the one of the things one of his models talks about was how he uh, had an armature, and then he would work with very small pieces of clay uh, to uh, to sort of build up the figure, and, and the uh, the models would sit for hours while he just worked on the armature, slowly building the image out. And uh, so I thought. Um, I was kind of inspired to make a piece of sculpture and I thought I'd make a bust of uh, Theo uh, because uh, Epstein never made a bust of Theo. Uh, so I thought I'd make a bust of Theo who was Epstein's son and work in the same way, although not using clay, using blocks of wood just to sort of build out slowly from that central, uh, almost like building out from the central spine uh, outwards. And what I'm trying to do now, this is uh, Theo here, I've got images of Theo here. Uh, what I'm trying to do now is just uh, try and work out on, work on the armature that will be uh, uh, his, his nose. So I'm just going to screw this in. So uh, we're uh, going to walk down by the canals in Warsaw to uh, find some uh, bits of detritus to uh, put into my uh, Theo garment bust. No one knows whether Theo Garman drank Carling Black Label, but I think uh, I think the inclusion of this tin uh, might add something to the sculpture. Not walk, don't hate, So, uh, yeah, I've been uh, making this uh, head of uh, Theo Garman, and uh, the idea is because uh, uh, Epstein never made a bust of Theo Garman, so I thought I'd make this bust. I'm sort of nearing, nearing completion with it now, and uh, it'll sort of be interesting to show you inside the mind of Theo, Theo Garman. So, come with me. I haven't quite finished the back of the head, and so you can see actually into into the mind of Theodore Garman. Yeah, so as, as I've been working on, over on it uh, the last two days, uh, I've been sort of building up the uh, these sections of bits of scrap wood which we're recycling from the uh, workshop here at Warsaw. And uh, one of the nice things about it is, is that, weirdly, I think it looks a lot like Theodore Garman, although you know, physically, it's quite different from him, and it's a, you know, it's kind of a big. I feel that it's a big sort of slightly unwanted lump. You know, it's, it's quite a, it's quite a bulbous, big sort of sculpture, really, and a bit gawky and uncomfortable, and uh, I feel slightly uneasy at its presence. And uh, strangely, I think it does actually. I don't think it, you know, physically looks a hell of a lot like him, but I think it is a bit like him. You know, in that it's big and a bit awkward. <laughs> 